Oh, Mokshita, hello. I haven't met you before. Hello, Jai. Hello, Shashank. Hello, Nivan. Good evening, Mom. Good evening. That's everybody, I think. Right. Good, good evening. evening. So, Arash, you look like you're in the wind. You've got a fan on. Is it hot there? You've got the fan. No, the cooler is working. Aha, uh -huh, lovely. So it must be hot to have that on, yeah? Yes, ma'am, and the cooler is on, like it does not have a remote. I can, I can, show, that, like, yeah. I can, I can show like this, this is the cooler. Oh. oh, that's it, I see, yes. Very nice. Nice that you can, that you need it. What right. You okay, so this, today, this afternoon, this evening for you. Mina. We're looking at G, but before we do G, we're actually going to talk about food. So I've got some questions in boxes and there are different things about food. So you're going to get to pick a number and then we're going to have to talk about what we find in box. So let me show you what I mean. That's not this one. We need to find. Uh, talk about food. Right. So this is a wheel so we're going to spin it round whenever it lands on we're all going to talk about so let me just get it so i can see all of you hopefully right here we go then let's see what we get so right so the question is what doesn't your family like to eat? So I'll answer first. My family doesn't like to eat meat. So we don't eat any meat here. Arush, is there something that your family doesn't like to eat or doesn't eat? So think about anything you don't have. Zero things we don't eat. So what things don't you eat? I don't eat like lots of things. I don't eat. There's nothing. You eat everything, do you? But but my parents like everything. Your parents like everything, but you might not. Okay, that's fine. Good answer. Jotsna, what doesn't your family like to eat? So we don't eat meat. What don't you have? Everything my family likes to eat is like no such thing. But I don't. But I don't like to eat with the god. Everybody likes, but I don't like. It's you don't like vegetables, but everybody else does. But we used to do it with the god dress. Uh, I get a theme here. I think some of the things your parents like, you don't like. I think that's what it is. Okay, Shashank. So, is there anything that your family doesn't have, doesn't like? Uh, we any family go. Indian cheese, honey, come on, get them, ma'am. Indian cheese, Indian. Indian cheese, you don't like that? Indian. Okay, I do. I think it's nice. Well, okay. Indian food. But you don't like it. Okay, that's fine. Uh, Moshita, Mokshita, sorry, I think I said your name right. What doesn't your family like to eat? Something you don't like? Uh, my family. Uh, my family doesn't like to eat. Doesn't like to eat uh, meat. Oh, just like mine. We don't eat meat either. So you are vegetarians, yes? So you mm. don't eat meat. Okay. Uh, but I like uh, chicken and fish. You like chicken and fish. Okay. Well, we don't eat meat, but we do eat fish. So we have some things, yeah. And you like chicken and fish. Okay, thank you, Mokshita. Thank you. Arnie. Thank you. Your turn. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. What doesn't your family like to eat? Ma'am, my family doesn't like to eat dosa and sambar. Dosa and sambar. I like both of those things, <laughs> but not everybody does. Okay. Dosa and sambar. Pagriti and Arav. He's going to answer this question. You're going to do it together? Yes. Okay, so what doesn't your family eat? My family eats broccoli too much and I don't like to eat broccoli. 
don't like broccoli. Broccoli's lovely. You don't like all the things I like. <laughs> Broccoli's good. It's nice. It's good for you too. But you don't eat it. That's fine. Okay, Arnie. I can't see you. Are you there? What now? So, what doesn't your family like to eat? Something you don't like? Mango and sambal. Mangoes, okay, and sambal. All right. I think sambal's really nice. Nivan, what does? Are you there? Nivan, hello. So, what doesn't your family like to eat? What's not good? Yeah. Okay. Maybe not. Mom is your. Oh, I see. Right. I think I can see you in two screens. No? Yeah. Oh, I see. I see. I see. I see. Oh, oh. Yeah, that didn't work. So, anything he doesn't like? I don't know. You don't know. All right. First, we'll leave that one. <laughs> okay. I'm going to get rid of that one. Am I going to do um, one more? No, we're not. Forget that. I'm just looking at the time. We might come back to that, but we need to get on with our letter. So the letter this week is G. Okay. Now, some of you may remember this story, but some of you will not. So if I share with you the story of G that we can come up with. So we're going to tell the story that goes along with the letter G. And then after that, I'm going to see how many words from the story you can remember beginning with G and we'll write them down. So this is a story I made up a little while ago. And the star of the story, the main character is this one. So this is Gordon, the grumpy gorilla. And once upon a time, there was a gorilla called Gordon, and he was very grumpy, always fed up, very stern face. He wasn't really very nice, actually. He was very, very grumpy. But he had a friend, and his friend was Geraldine, the gorgeous giraffe. And she was quite happy. She was a nice giraffe, and she got on quite well with Gordon, whereas nobody else did. So Gordon and Geraldine. Now, they live in a part of Africa called the Gambia. There's the word Gambia. In Africa, on the coast. Quite hot there. And in the Gambia, Gordon had a few jobs. He had a few dream jobs. And his dream job was to be a guard. Does anyone know where this guard works in this picture. Um, palace. Buckingham Palace, yeah, this is a, a Queen's Guard from UK. Yeah, the... They wear these things on their head called bear skins. They're very hot to wear. Queen Elizabeth. Queen Elizabeth, that's right. And they guard her outside her palace. And this is taken outside Buckingham Palace. And they never laugh. They're very stern. So it would have been a good job for Gordon because he never laughed either. He was really grumpy. So he would like to be a guard at Buckingham Palace, but Geraldine loved her garden and she wanted to be a gardener, growing pretty flowers and trees and all sorts of things. So they were quite different, but they were good friends. They also had some hobbies. Who plays golf? Anybody play golf? No, I don't either, but Gordon did. Gordon's favourite game was golf. And he was very lazy, so he used to go around in his golf cart in between the holes and have lots of fun like that. That's what he liked to do. Geraldine, she was a bit more adventurous. She liked to fly in her glider. Does anybody know something about a glider? Something it doesn't have. Oh, Rush, you look like you might know. A glider doesn't have something that most planes would have. Any idea? Is that wheels? Uh, it doesn't it's have wheels. No, no, it doesn't have passengers. It has only it, 
Island. doesn't have an engine. That's what I was going for. There has no engine. So a glider has to be pulled up into the air by an aeroplane on, on a rope. And then they let it go and it glides around on the hot air up above. And eventually it has to land because it will just come down. But it catches something called thermals and so it flies around up high until it runs out and then it has to come down. No engine, no fuel, it just glides. So it's a bit dangerous actually, but uh, that's Geraldine for you. She was quite an adventurous giraffe. Now, look at all these places beginning with G. Geraldine and Gordon had one thing in common and that was travel. They like to travel. So what places begin with G? Let's have a look. So right up here, Greenland. What do you think it's like in Greenland? Do you think it's a hot country or what do you think it's like? Anyone? No, it's very cold because it's near the North Pole. Guatemala and Grenada, they're both quite hot in the middle of America's there. In Africa, of course, we've got Ghana and the Gambia where they come from. And in Europe, we have Greece, Gibraltar, Georgia, and Germany. So lots and lots of G places all over the world. Now the other word that begins with G is about food. And we talked about food this morning, gastronomy. Gastronomy is what Gordon and Geraldine really liked, good food. Choosing, cooking and eating good food, posh food, top restaurants, gastronomy, gourmet food. So they're a bit picky. They like really, really good food. And so they used to go around all these countries eating all the gourmet food in the best restaurants. But some of their favourites were not particularly gourmet. They were just nice things. Who likes gingerbread? Um, I'm Gingerbread biscuits, that's right. They look nice, don't they? Do you like them? These ones are gingerbread men, so they look like they've got faces and little buttons. Who knows what this is? This is called guacamole. So this is a dip made of avocados. Garlic. Gordon loved garlic and it made him smell because garlic's got a very strong smell. Grapes and Greek yogurt. Greek yogurt's my favourite. So lots of foods beginning with G as well. Now one day, game show. One day they were on a game show, I'm a good. massive game show, and they did very very well, and they won a gold, a great big bar of gold called an ingot, a great big bar of gold. That's a lot of gold. They were amazed. They had done so well. And they'd done so well that they decided to travel all around the world. Goodbye. Goodbye. Yeah. So we've got quite a few things in that story. I think that's the end. Quite a few things beginning with G, haven't we? So I want to see what you can remember. All right. So what we'll do, I'm going to put the whiteboard up. And then I want you to think... I'm going to ask you all in turn to tell me two things from the story. Okay. All right. So instead of everybody shouting out, we're going to do it two at a time. So I'll ask somebody two words. I'll write them down, then I'll move to the next person. Because otherwise, I can never hear what you're all saying, and I don't get them written down properly. Now, Arash, you're going to be going first. And I'm going to want you to give me, I'm going to make the board a bit bigger here. We've learned how to do this. So I want, Arash, I would like you to tell me two things from the story, beginning with G. What can you remember? Gorilla. 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 Uh, 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 at, uh, gorilla. What's your other one, Arash? Grumpy. 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 It was grumpy. Gordon was grumpy. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Remember. But you don't shout out, you'll get your turn. Right. Grumpy gorilla. Okay, Jotsna, now it's your turn. Can you tell me 
two things from the story beginning with G. Um, Greenland. Say that one again. Greenland and Greece. I didn't quite get that. Yeah. Greenland, oh, Greenland and Greece. Sorry, oh, yes, I did get you. Greenland, two countries then. Greenland, Greece. Shashank, your turn. Two things. Uh, giraffe and Green Island. Giraffe and <laughs> Greenland. Gorgeous. Giraffe and what yeah. else? Greek York. Gorgeous. Go. Wonderful. Well done. Yeah. Hey, Preeti, you got two things for me? What about some food? Gingerbread. Yeah. Say that again, I missed it. Garlic. Garlic, well done. Another one? Did you say gingerbread as well? Yes. Yeah, I thought so. Okay, Mokshita, can you think of two things from the story? Um, um, garden. Garden, well done. That's what Geraldine garden. likes. Garden. Um, green. Green. Greenland. Oh, we've got Greenland already. What did Geraldine like to fly in? What was that called? Do you remember the thing that had no engine? See there? Glider. Do you remember? Like the aeroplane that didn't have an engine. It's a glider. Arnie, have you got two things for me? Yes, ma'am. Two things beginning with G from the story then. Yes, ma'am. Game show yes. and gold. Game show and gold. Gold. Well done. Yes, they won the gold bar, didn't they? Okay, right. We need some more. All rush. Some more. Two more things. Three. Which one? What about, let's think about the countries. We've got Greenland and Greece. There are more countries, wasn't there? Was the place in Africa? There's two African countries. There's that one. Ghana? Yeah, and there was the other one where they came from. It was the something, do you remember? Yeah. The Gambia. The Gambia, yes. Can you think of any more food? Garlic. We've got garlic. We've got garlic and gingerbread. There were some other things. Okay. Um, Yop snack. Have you got some? Two things. Can you think of? Everyone else get. What? God. Yes, you want to get God at Buckingham Palace. You're right. What was his favourite game? What was the game he played? Did you want to go? Did you want to go? Golf, yes. And he had a golf buggy. Right, okay. So Did you want to go? let's see. Golf Just buggy. if you can think of something, if you Man, goose. Up, I'll ask you. Mark Sheet, have you thought of something? Mangoes. Mangoes. Goose goose. Was that, what was that in the, it's got to be something from the story? Uh, Beginning with Ga. What about, um, uh, oh, I know, what about this one? What does this say? Geraldine was a gardener, wasn't she? She liked to do her garden. Oh, we, we've got garden as well. I'm struggling to think of any more. If anyone's got any more, you can call them out now, okay? Morning. 
Golden color. We've got the gold. We've got the gold. Just from the store. Golden story. color. Golden. Not gold. Golden, ma'am. Golden. Well, that. Yeah, okay. Have a look at. Let's see. Were there any more countries? Guatemala. Germany. I'll think of any more. Oh, and what did he say at the end? What's the word that you say when you're going and you're leaving? You say goodbye. Goodbye. Yes. Okay. Right. I think we're going to leave that. The glacier. We'll leave that list there, I think, because I've got a little game for you next. Game, so, game. You know, in the story, Gordon and Gorilla, they like to travel. Gordon and uh, Geraldine like to travel. And I've got some travel anagrams for you. So who knows what anagrams are? Anagrams are mixed up words. And these mixed up words are all to do with traveling. Okay. So it might be things like case or airplane or bus or something like that. So if you have a look, I just need to open it up. So this is all about travel, travel anagrams. All right. So you've got to think about what it might be. You'll get a jumbled up word. You can work out what it is. So, where do you go before traveling by planes? Here's all the letters. Airport. It is airport. Right, now I've got to move the letters around to get them in the right order. How do we spell airport then? What's the first letter? So I'm going to move the letters. If you tell me what comes next, see if we can get it right. I. Yeah. Oh. It would be hard then push. There we go. Uh, what comes next? Uh, uh, yeah, well done. Ardman. Uh, I know, it's not letting me do it. Why is it not? I think it's because the. Two Ardman, two, two uh, countries. It's just because I've got so many of you on the video. There we go. Ed, What's next? H, ma'am, H. Whoever said that was right. There we go, airport. Right, let's see another one. Right. Verb, that's a doing word, meaning to go from one place to another. What do you think this word should be? Did someone say the word? Travel, this should be. So, what's the first letter? Travel. Okay, what's next? That's right. I, what should go there? I, ma'am, I, I, ma'am, did you want to get I? There you go, a, travel. A, two, right, let's see who can get this one first. Pay for something before you use it to make sure it's yours. What's this word going uh, to be? Arm. Um, what do you think it's going to be? Food. Book. You book a holiday, don't you? What's the first it's letter? Arm. Um, B O O K. You're right. Let's see if we can do it. Well done. Oh, I'm sure that's right. Book. You book a holiday, don't you? You book it. Okay. Let's see what's next. Right. To save something in your name to use for later. Pay for it later. Well, you might do this um, to get your seat on an aeroplane or a train. So if you want a spe specific seat, you have to do this. I'll give you a clue. It starts with R. What do you think the word might be? And, and B, man, B. Anyone know what this word could be? B. Not sure okay so you reserve your seat don't you what do you think comes yes. next yes, mom. yeah yes, oh why doesn't it do it you reserve your seat that's right not letting me do it is it why is it not e. 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 
There we go. What we... was that? I don't know why I wouldn't let me do that. Okay, what does this say? Go to another city or country to relax. What do you think this word should be, anyone? Holiday. Holiday. Well holiday. done. Oxford. Holiday. How do we spell holiday? H O L L. Yeah. Right. Not letting me do it. L I. Is it I? Oh, that's it. That's better. What? Um, and, 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 why won't it let me do that? You're right, and it won't let me do it. Why? <laughs> okay, well, it is AY, but for some reason that's not working. But it is holiday. All right, there's a couple more. Go from one place to another. How you travel? You go on a aeroplane. It's what you call the trip. Journey. Journey. Yes, Arash. Journey. How do we spell it, Arash? J. Yeah. O. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Why, Mom? It's not going. It's not letting. Oh, there we are. Yeah. J O. You. Yeah. You're right. Good. That's it. E M E uh, I. Yeah. R. E. E M E N U Y. Yeah. It's E Y. Okay. Why is it? What's happening? For some reason, it doesn't want me to do this, does it? You are right, it is E-Y, and I don't know why it's gone wrong. Right, let's see if the next one will get it right. Another world, another word for journey. This is a short one. E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-E-
एक स्टोरी सुनाना है मैम स्टोरी सुनने का मन है मैम थोड़ी सुनाने का मन है मैम आपको